All right, guys, it's V-Sing here, and we're back with Gotta Pick Em All for round three. And, of course, I'm not alone. I'm joined by Firefly Kiri. Hey, guys, it's Firefly Kiri. And, like last week, we have not one, but we have two special guests this week. First up, we have KLG24601, a.k.a. Kendra. Hi! Yo, nice intro, Kendra. And we also have uh, Gerds. Today. Uh, hi, Gerds. Hi, Gerds. How are you, Gerds? <laughs> That's all I gotta say from my intro. Today. <laughs> today, people. I do. Today, today, today. And today. 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 <laughs> so today, oh people, my. today, we're gonna be... Who, we're gonna be picking who we think will do good in round three today. So today... <laughs> <laughs> today, today, Stop today. <laughs> right, so what's the first battle, Erica? Uh, well, it's uh, Trent versus Ace. <laughs> Why, why you gotta start with that one? That's a tricky one. <laughs> <sighs> because it was the first one on the channel launch. You know what? Ace. I'm not. Yeah, I was gonna say let Grids go. Why, why you think it's Ace Grids? I don't know. Ace is just a really freaking good battler. Even though he's like he's very simple when it comes to battling, but he's he's still like top tier, very good. So I don't know. I don't think I don't think many people's gonna be beating Ace. It's one of those if it's not broke if it's not broke don't fix it type things like he's simple yeah. but it works. Yeah. All right, so it's one for Ace already, uh, Kendra. Um, I do think Ace will win because I feel like he has a lot of experience breaking through stall like Trent's team. Although yeah. I do feel it will be a pretty close battle. Like it's I don't feel like it's going to be just someone gets destroyed. I feel like it's going to be a good battle. Okay. Uh, Erica? Uh, honestly, I'll probably have to go with Ace as well, because like like uh, our two guests have stated, Ace is a really good battler for one. And for two, this this <laughs> this guy is just uh, he's just Sometimes he's a little too overconfident. I will say that. Ace uh, oh is. god, yeah. <laughs> okay. I, he 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 can get kind of a big head, and but Ace is a good battler, and I guess he like he's gone undefeated so far. Yeah, he's undefeated. So, but um, isn't no Trent isn't or is he? Trent Trent is one zero. I mean one one. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. He's uh, won one, lost one. Yeah, I feel like, um, like, Trent's a really good battler, but, like, I don't know, I feel like he's just, he lacks at something. Well, Ace has more, um, He has more experience. He has more league experience. Yeah, but, like, I don't know. Hubba, what do you think? I'm kind of have to go with the, the majority here and say Ace, uh, Pretty much for the same reasons you all said, he has more experience in general, more experience in a league format. And personally, I know that he takes pride in destroying stall teams, which is <laughs> kind of what Trent has. Like, um, <clears throat> I don't know if you guys know, but like, there's that that generic stall team that everyone uses on Showdown. It's like Chansey, Mega Sableye, Skarmory, Amoongus, Quagsire, like just flat out bulk and he mm -hmm. takes pride in coming up against that while he's laddering and completely destroying it each and every time. So I believe it. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's not he's not scared <laughs> of the stall. Like it, it frustrates him like it does all of us, but he knows how to work around it. Okay, Cotney. No, like, yeah, yeah, Cotney. Um <laughs> <laughs> But uh Trent's not bad. We know he's not bad. I just think he's too rel like he relies too heavily on his stall tactics. And Ace is very good at punishing people for that. Like Ace will be like, okay, fine. He's if he's gonna play this game, I know he's gonna I know he's going to either roost or moonlight or whatever this turn, so I will swap out or do something to put himself in an advantage situation. And I feel like that's what's gonna happen. And Ace yeah. and Ace I, I, I feel like this will be a comfortable win for Ace. I do. Nothing against Trent. Trent is good. I, just, no. I think Ace is better. <laughs> no. Ace is a good I mean Ace is a good He's top tier. Ace. All right. Top tier. He's like <clears throat> chic. Whenever Ace, I'm like, oh my gosh. Uh, whenever like Trent's like freaking, I don't know, like you know, Donkey Trent. Kong or some shit. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Trent is a Wario. 
The Wario's not good though. Try, okay, Wario. Okay, we're not gonna talk about Smash. Um, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right. So Erica, what's up next? <laughs> oh, two of our favorite people in the world, Max versus Jakeeb. Hello. Why you guys say that, man? That's I love mean. Max. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Max is awesome. <laughs> yeah, that Max is great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, since, Jakey, but Max since, is awesome. Since we let <laughs> since we let Grids go first this time, Kendra, oh, you gotta do tell it. us who's gonna win out of Max and Jakey. I I don't know if I actually think he's gonna win, but I really want Max to win. I think Why are you guys win. there like that? <laughs> what? Uh, Wait, that's kind of biased. I mean, I'm not gonna right. lie. I, I want the same shit, niggas. <laughs> I mean, I do anyway. too, but I'm not gonna be that biased. <laughs> anyway, can uh -huh. so you I want think... Max to win, but do you think he will? I think he will. I think if Max could beat out Trent, then I feel like he can uh, overcome Jakeeb because I feel like in some ways Jakeeb is just a lesser Trent. Um, yeah. just a lot of bulk and stall. With with a worse with, with a with a Weevil. <laughs> that that too. Fourteen normal I mean, types. I mean, Jakeeb has uh Weevil, Chansey, Milotic, like that Mega Pidgeot. FYI. Yeah, like I was gonna point out, like people keep missing out in Mega Pidgeot in the first two rounds. That's the reason Jakeeb won, more or less. Like Rich, and... you weren't prepared for Mega Pidgeot well, so. Uh. I don't know. He's it... a great battler, but like he's, I don't know. I, like to Max, I think that's a very even battle. I so, feel like yeah. Max will be able to work around the Pidgeot. I think I'm both so have a shot at winning. I don't really know. All right, Grids. Well, you got to pick one. I feel like it's more Max than Jakeeb, but I think they're both very even. So your pick is Max. Yeah. Max well, is a good I battler. mean, like yeah. And same with Jakeeb. I don't know. Ninja Keep had a really, really good battle, along with me and Max having a, I don't know, it was a decent battle, it wasn't that great. You, but... <laughs> you kind of ra you kind of raged in your video. I was going to say, like, Grid, you, you battled both of these guys in the first two rounds, so you have yeah. first-hand experience. They're very, very close to, like, I don't know, maybe the bird, like, both the birds that they have. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> bird. they're very, very close in, like, I don't know, I don't, I don't want to say skill level, but, like, I don't know, way the battle, or, I don't know, it's weird. Who do you think will win? <sighs> I gotta go with Max. <laughs> uh, nice. Not not just because I want him to win. Um, I just feel he he is a better battler, and overall his draft is slightly better yeah. as well. Like like Jakeep has good stuff on his draft. I just feel, don't feel like it works well together. Like we say all the time, you bring knockoff Dream Punch and you win against Jakeep, and it's kind of true. Our after destroyed my ass, so. Yeah, like Star Raptor is a threat to Jakeeb. I don't think Jakeeb has much of an answer for it. Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, like Kendra was saying, Max broke through Trent. So I think he'll do the same with Jakeeb. Yeah. So, Erica, yep. what are um, your thoughts? Um, Honestly, I think Max is going to win because he does have something very good to counter that uh, Pidgeot. And we're all just together today. <laughs> <laughs> and, and that, and the reason for that is Jolteon. Jolteon? Jolteon? Jolteon can handle the Mega Pidgeot. That's true. And, you know, Mega Pidgeot, yes, it's a good mon. It's, it's number one on top five killers right now. And I want, I, I personally, me and Demon have both agreed that uh, we both want to see Mega Pidgeot knock down a couple slots on the top five. Because it's been on top five killers for two we for two rounds in a row. Uh, we want to see other mons, so Max, get get one of your mons up there. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's, it's pretty. It's pretty savage. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I've caught it first hand. <laughs> Heat wave. I caught about 400 hurricanes to the mouth, so. That's yeah. so painful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're all in agreement that we believe that Max is gonna end up yeah. taking this one. Yeah. I sure hope so. 
Oh, I can do. That's real nice. Well, I'm an awful person. Sorry. Well, uh, well V-Sing, I'm gonna let you pick the the first one for this next match. Uh -huh. And the next match is our own Pachi Pachi YT against Mega Sonic's Hero PVP. The uh, <laughs> Las Vegas Fantinis versus the Levert and Leafyogs. We haven't been yeah. saying team names. <laughs> They're on the screen. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> uh, Zach versus Daniel. This is gonna be fun. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I I gotta go with my instinct and say Zach purely because of Mega Low Honey in that I feel Daniel doesn't have much for it. <clears throat> like genuinely. I just don't, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't see Daniel figuring out a way to get around Mega Low Honey with his draft. True. That, 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 that's all I can go on. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, I don't have much to say about this one. Like, both guys have something to prove. Neither of them have won a battle yet. So, yeah. they'll be out for blood, and I think Zach will pull it out this week. Uh, okay. I mean, same, honestly. I don't. Uh, it's For me, it's purely skill level. Like, Zach. You say okay. Zach's a better battler? Yeah. Okay, so I'm guessing you're going to go with Zach. Yeah, Zach. <laughs> the easy one. Alright, then Kendra. Um, I do think Zach will win. He keeps telling me that he's gonna 6 0 him. I don't think he will. Not just because I want to keep my, my title of being the only person to get a 6 0 in the CCL, but I, I really do. I'm an awful person. Yeah, I, throw I, didn't that up here. I didn't really realize I was such an awful person until this recording. But. <laughs> But you are, and ironically, the person you got a six L from is who he who he's battling against this week. Mm hmm. So I think that Zach will be able to pull through, but it's not going to be as much of a destruction as he thinks it is. Yeah. Okay. I, I disagree. You think it will be a destruction? I think it will be a destruction. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of feel like it will be a destruction as well. Like Mega Little Bunny just going to go in. Yeah. But I'm America. America. Oh, okay. Sorry. Um, I'm gonna have to go with Zach. I mean, th because mostly because, for one, nothing on Daniel's team, like you said, wants to to take on Mega Low Punny. Um, another thing is Zach has the Lando, and really. I think the only thing that would be able to handle the Lando on Daniel's team is Vaporeon with the Ice Beam. That's true. Or, you know, and then he also, you know, Zach has Suicune, he has the Beatus, uh, he has Nambay. So, I, I, I think that, I think Zach will pull through in this, this round. I think he'll finally get his first win. Yeah. We're, we're still unanimous. Yeah. <laughs> well, here's the next match. Oh. So, it's our own your boy Grizz versus Hakeem. Can I go? Yeah, you want to go, go first, Grizz? Yeah, uh, Hakeem. <laughs> <laughs> why, why are you so, like, un like unconfident in yourself? Because I'm fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying Hakeem is just far superior to you? I legit may get two wins this whole this whole season. Maybe. <laughs> There's a possibility. Maybe one. Maybe. So I don't know. I I, I got two in my head that I think I can beat. Okay. Already been. That's probably it. <laughs> <laughs> the rest I think I'm getting by. <laughs> I'm not. Well, I'm not. I don't know. I have a chance. Everybody has a chance. Yeah. I, I don't know. Well, yeah, but um, honestly, I am. I kind of going to have to disagree with Grizz. I think that Grizz might actually win. And it, there, there is a reason why. And I'm not sure if I should say it since Grizz is he sitting here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But do it. Yeah. Well, for one. If you look at Hakeem's draft, he ha he has so 
many fairies. Yeah, you got Gardevoir in that gun. You have, you have, you have Garnabay. Pixelate Gardevoir. Come at me. You have, you have Garnabay. But there is a couple of Mons on your team that get pretty decent steel moves. Great. To take out his fairies. And Garnabay can handle his guard chomp. You know, you just gotta watch out for the Lucario and the Snorlax. Yeah, but I still feel like I'm gonna lose the but you know. It's okay. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna be I'm gonna put my faith in grids this round. Oh, like that's a smart idea. Eric. <laughs> well I'm giving you a shot, don't let me down. <laughs> well, I've done told you that. <laughs> be sing. <laughs> okay, but Eric, Be sing, what do you yeah, think? One of you. Uh, sorry, Grizz, but I'm gonna go with Hakeem. I mean, yeah, I, like, obviously, I think I'm gonna lose, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, and I have one very specific reason for picking Hakeem, and that's, uh, I think his Snorlax will give you a lot of work. Because your three OU picks are all out special attackers, and Snorlax can come in, eat all the hits, then just set up curses in your face. Because there's not much you can do about it, because you can't really hit him that hard on the physical side. Uh, mm, I would disagree. Cro crocodile. Yeah, crocodile. Well, crocodile, but like, yeah, it can eat those It's a super too. punch, nigga. A, a super punch. I <laughs> fuck. <laughs> can I change my pick <laughs> now? <laughs> Just for that. Yeah, dang it. <laughs> Even in my video, like Jakeem, I was like, "Yo, I'm about to land this super punch." I was like, "What now?" <laughs> <laughs> dang it, dude. Whatever. Catch a superpower. I don't know, I, I still think Snorlax will give you problems. And I, I think mean, Mega I, Deontay I will give you problems. I feel like it will too. I, 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 I didn't tell you, I think I'm gonna lose. Yeah. I don't, think, I don't think he'll body you. I think it'll be close though. But yeah, I'll go yeah. with the key. So Kendra. I, I, I'm I kind of glad that I got to go last because I've been very undecided. And I, I think I was thinking to go with grades, but after hearing all this stuff, I think I would have to go with Hakeem. Like, okay. I didn't really think about the Snorlax so much, and Snorlax is a big problem. I don't like facing Snorlaxes. They are not fun. Anything that can curse and then go to sleep makes me <laughs> makes me really angry. Let's just hope you don't think about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's Hakeem. Oh, I mean... I, I know how Hakeem battles. Well, I mean, you, I, you don't know. But I, I agree with Beasting. I think it's going to be a close battle. I feel like um, Hakeem hasn't been taking this too seriously, and um, which is fine and great and all that. Like, I'm not saying everyone should be all like, I want to win, I want to win, got to do all the things. But I feel like Grids definitely has a chance, but that Hakeem will pull through and get a fairly narrow victory. All right. Well, the next battle is an interesting one. <laughs> it's Marty versus Lee. That's... <laughs> Can I go? Oh, sure, Grizz, go for it. Lee? <laughs> All right. Why? I don't know. Lee's good. Okay. <laughs> Marty's not that good. That's all I got. Okay. There you go. Uh, Lee. Fee Sync. <laughs> Lee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Lee, Lee's skill level is infinitely superior to Marty's. Not that Marty's terrible, it's just Marty's kind of inexperienced. That's all. He's slowly getting better. He is. There's one he word is. on that. He's slow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little too slow to stand a chance. <laughs> like, if he was, like, battling someone, like, lower ranked, like, from the power rankings, I could give Marty a shot, but Lee is a consistent great battler. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, he's one and one, but, like, like, the one loss was to Kendra, who's one of our best, no offense, grids. What? <laughs> um, well, I mean, you also gotta look, Marty is one and one as well. I mean, Isn't the one he beat Daniel? Yeah. Yeah. I don't think that you can. Why did you apologize to me? 
Because I said Kendra's one of our best, implying that you weren't. I, I, I didn't think I what, what? <laughs> Never Why mind. You it's, it's fine. Don't worry about it. So who, who, who are we doing? Kendra, you talking about Lee and Marty? Um, yep. I feel like Lee will win, but I honestly think Mega Sableye can go in and put in some work if Marty thinks about it. Keyword there, if Marty thinks. A not word phrase. That was three words. Um, so, Lee better be careful. He gotta make sure that Alakazam can destroy that thing before it sets up. Because with Alakazam and Kafagrigus both sitting there, and the threat of magic bounce, I feel like Sableye does have a decent chance to just set up and go through things if Lee's not careful about it. Yeah, but Mega Alakazam gets Dazzling Gleam. The Dazzling Gleam, yeah. Which is is scary. But, you know, Just if Marty the thinks... Gleam. that Again, key phrase. If Marty if. thinks and invests specially, doesn't Mega Evolve, gets a prankster calm mind... I feel like there's... If, if Marty plays smart and Lee doesn't play smart, I feel like it might not be a total destruction. All right. Well, I'm just gonna go with. Uh, I'm just gonna make it unanimous and go with Lee. Just well, why Lee? Why not Lee? You right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, why not Lee? I mean, Granddaddy Lee. He, Granddaddy Lee's scary, Granddaddy. man. Granddaddy Lee has a. I mean, it's an interesting draft, but he's still got a scary draft. Plus, he has Cream Puff. I still can't believe I beat him, to be totally honest. Like, oh my gosh. Like I but said, Lee you're is one, one of the best. Yeah, Lee is one of these people, though. He, he's, he's, him and Demon are so alike that it's not even funny. Where they, they just like to bring stuff like randomness. I feel like Lee isn't as much like that as people like to think. Like, from the what I've seen from him, like, it's different, but I feel like it's not as different as people think it is. I feel that's like that's opinion. because Lee's being safer for now. I think that's true. once he gets, like, a good lead on some people and he's got, like, a like a nice safe safety net of victories, he'll start experimenting because he can. That's true. But yeah. So again, what well, unanimous for Lee? Yep. Yep. So what's up next, Erica? <laughs> it is Woot versus Chris. <laughs> oh, God. This is this is a really tricky one. And I don't want to go first, so Erica, I, you go first. I, oh. yeah, I you go first. I want to no, go no, no. first. Okay. Oh, fine, fine. Okay. Eric, uh, Kendra, go first. Uh, Kendra, go first. I think that Wyatt will win. I have full faith in Wyatt's battling abilities. I've seen a lot of his preps for other battles and all kinds of things. Like, he is really good. And after Chris getting pretty blown back last week, I have a lot more confidence in Wyatt than I do in Chris. And uh, I know that people are saying that Chris's first battle against Slayer was really close and all that I feel like just in my opinion although I will admit I'm kind of biased um I you think, think? <laughs> uh, I think Chris didn't really play as well against Slayer as people are saying like I know I've said it in a couple of comments on the video like Slayer plays to exploit people's bad plays and he recognized that that was going to happen. The Koopa, Draco, whatever the frick it was. Um, and so I feel like Chris isn't as good as people think in this league in particular. I think maybe he with his draft or something. Like, I don't know. I'm making a lot of words and I feel like I stopped making sense. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, so what? Let's... Yes. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Next. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to go with. 
Uh, I think I'm going to go with Wyatt. But, uh, Kendra, we all know she's biased, so I'm going to actually look at the drafts <laughs> mm. when it comes to my picking and the battle experience. Well, if you look, Wyatt's team is, is it's pretty well balanced. Wyatt's team is freaking beast. That steel fairy yeah. dragon is disgusting. Yeah. That's that and that's a good steel fairy dragon core. It makes that me want to why it has. Place. And honestly, I mean Chris technically has a steel dragon fairy core as well. In Aromatease, Kingdra and uh Farathorn. Farathorn. But I I I feel like from the past battles with Chris, I I just don't think he can pull through against Wyatt. I mean, Woot is one and one, and Chris has lost all of his battles so so far. So I real I really believe that um, Woot's gonna win. So Hubba, mm -hmm. who do you think's gonna win? <clears throat> I'm gonna have to go with Wyatt, <clears throat> not because he's better or anything. I actually feel their skill level is equal, uh, because I know Chris, Chris's battle style very well from the past. Uh, I know Wyatt's pretty well as well now. Uh, they're on par with each other. I just feel Wyatt all around has a better draft, and I also feel Chris is prone to succumb to pressure, like he will buckle under the pressure and he pretty much chokes and I feel like that will cost him again he gets nervous and he gets the thoughts of you know what I'm trash and he just gives in and stops thinking about plays so yeah I think I think he'll choke you think he'll choke mm -hmm. have to give it All to right. you have to give it to Wyatt Gertz. oh shit okay let's yell um ah uh, Wyatt <laughs> yeah okay any uh, any specific reason? I, I don't know. Like I've I've also seen Chris's battle style because I've been here a long time. So, right. Yeah, but uh, I don't know. They're they're both really good. It's just I don't know. I feel like Wyatt's team is a little bit better. All right. Well, another unanimous decision with Woot. And uh, <laughs> okay, the next battle. <laughs> Kendra versus Beesing. Beesing. <laughs> Beesing go first. Wait, why did you just go Kendra then? Oh, wait, Beesing. <laughs> oh, wait, uh, let's say Kendra because she started laughing. Uh, you know what, fine, we're going to come to you first then, Grades. Beesing. Why? <laughs> why me? Because you're great. <laughs> why am I great? I'm not great. No, you're freaking better than all of us. I don't mind. Okay, fine. I'll shut my mouth. Don't shut your mouth. Don't do that. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> you lied. Yeah. So you're going with me? Yeah, you. Okay. Erica. Come back to me. <laughs> no, no. No, you do. Now. You do now. Diddy mouth. Chop the boo shit. Feels. Diddy mouth. Mouth dee dee. Alright, alright. Well, even though. Beesing, you have Slayer's Draft with the Did Mega Pinsir. <laughs> I gotta go with Kendra. Hello. I love you, but I gotta go with Kendra. <laughs> Why? I'm, I, I, I just, I feel like you can't get past some of her minds, and I. I like, since you're both here, I don't want to say too much. Yeah. <laughs> because I don't want to give either one of you ideas. Yeah. Probably, if, even if you didn't bring it up, Basing probably already had it. <laughs> I've probably already thought. <laughs> I mean, he's good. You're right. <laughs> I'm scared. All right. Done, dear, Kendra. Uh, I really like my team, and I'm really proud of my team, and I think my team can do well, but Hubba is Hubba. <laughs> <laughs> Hubba's a god. I'm terrified. I think he's gonna beat me, and I'm gonna die. 
Hey, so hey, you hey, pick hey, her butt? Wait, I'm not a god, I'm the god. No, no, no. I, I shall god. not say that. Okay. I'm god. Okay, you need to chill right now. <laughs> now uh, you're Lord so, and Savior. So you, now you're not. So, you, <laughs> so, so, you, so you, you're picking V-Sing. I am picking V-Sing. Because I am terrified. I don't want to lose. He's going to beat me. I'm scared. Well, I mean, technically, you're both undefeated right now. <laughs> hey, she, she doesn't want this Keckley on work. Nah, she just I, had two shitty people in a row. That's all I need. <laughs> that, I, mean, I had I fought I fought Lee. <laughs> you call it Lee that? Nah, Lee's good. I just tried I just tried to make a funny shut up. Mm. Be sync. <sighs> uh honestly I'm gonna have to go with Kendra. I'm not confident in my I I'm confident in my abilities and stuff, I'm just not really confident in my prep work for this round. <laughs> uh I've not had a lot of time to actually sit and think yet, so I feel like Kendra has, because she's so scared of me, has sat for like weeks upon weeks for this. You're and right. thought out multiple, <laughs> she, now she's made up equations and formulas and... <laughs> I, I, I wish. I <laughs> but uh, I, right now, like off the top of my head, I haven't even started prepping yet, but off the top of my head, I know I don't have much for Victini. I know I don't. Uh, but uh, everything else I can kind of handle-ish. Um, I guess Septile's Cabalion. a bit of an issue. Cab and I have things for Cabalion. Uh, that, that's okay. It's more Victini and Septile I'm scared of. But like I feel like Kendra will have... Bosses. Yeah, I will have, Kendra will have prepped extremely well for me. And I feel my prep will let me down. And I will go in there and something will happen. I'll be like, oh shit, that's not something I thought she'd bring. Or something like that. And I think it will cost me. And I, I am also prone to choking a lot, like Chris. Um, I proved that in Season 1 of the CCL, my first two battles against Slayer and Ace. I choked. <laughs> I just feel like us all just didn't want to pick ourselves, so you feel like we was a dick. Sorry? I just feel like we... <laughs> I, feel, I feel like all of us just didn't want to pick ourselves, because we felt like we'd be a dick. <laughs> oh no, last week I picked myself. I was like, I'm a Did you really? Demon. Yeah. Hello? <laughs> 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 Yeah, I was confident as hell, Chris. That was self-righteous, man. <laughs> so, the very last battle is Ben versus Demon. Ah, uh, ben, ben versus D? Demon. Yeah. Demon. Our D. Demon. Ah. Uh. Demon. Oh, Greg, do you want to go first? Yeah. Yep. All right, go. <sighs> this is a. This, I think this will be a great battle, no doubt. Because Demon has the mindset of like a freaking crazy person. Because <laughs> this freaking <laughs> shit that he comes up with is crazy. Uh, um, there's no way I'm winning. There we battle. There ain't no way. Uh, <laughs> and Ben has the God Draft. The God Draft. So the God it's, Draft. I think that Ben's gonna win. Basically All because right. of the draft. <laughs> That's legit. That that V sync put together for him. That's legit. <laughs> the only reason that I think he's gonna win. Because I wish I had that draft. <laughs> that like yeah, I think anybody that had that draft probably could win. <laughs> even in, even in Daniel's hands, that draft is scary. Yeah, no. it's like I, don't I know. disagree. No. <laughs> not Daniel, no, but like uh, anybody else, yeah, probably except maybe not Marty or me. But like, <laughs> yeah, anybody else, probably yeah. All right, V sync. Who do you think's gonna win? This is my pick for Battle of the Week purely because I feel like Eamon's skill level is infinitely higher than Ben's, but Ben's draft kind of balances it out. So I feel they're on equal footing. Demon's a better battler, but in my opinion, Ben's draft is much better. But um, it's going to be extremely close, but I have to give it to Ben because of the regen core and Mega Absol being a huge issue for everyone, everywhere ever existing <laughs> because it's like it's like um jakeev's mega pidgeot people just forget about it and sleep on it mega absol is the same people forget about it because it's not like a top tier ou mega it's it's terrifying especially in this format like if it gets a sars dance up it kind of sweeps teams yeah so i i have to give it to ben <laughs> uh kendra <laughs> your turn <laughs> I don't want to pick one. You have to. I don't want to. What the fuck wrong with you? Just pick a fucking you name. You have to. 
Oh gosh. Do any mini money mo if you have to. Don't play this I drama shit, Nick. I think that demon is really, really good. I feel that even though Ben's draft is terrifying, that I feel like Demon would be able to pull out a win against him just because Ben isn't as familiar with this whole competitive game as much and demon is just so insane in a good way mostly um that he'll be able to beat out ben but i feel like it will be a really good match and that it'll be close all right so you pick demon yes i picked demon all right so since i'm the final one i I think <sighs> Demon's such a good battler. I like when he brings the off the wall shit, except for the fucking Lapras. <laughs> Fuck the Lapras. Lapras, Lapras? Fuck the Lapras. I hate that stupid. <sighs> but Ben has the draft from the gods. That's me. <laughs> 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 and I mean Ben has like 50 million volt turners on his draft too I mean he could just sit there and you turn volt switch all day long if he wanted to um I love you demon but I'm gonna have to go with Ben and it's mostly for the Mostly for the draft. You're 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 a better better battler than he is, but I don't think you can get I don't think you can get by by his draft. But I think it's going to be a very 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 close battle. Yeah, I think the demon will do good as well. So I, I think they both have a chance of winning. Yeah. Hmm? I think this is the most even one, in my mm -hmm. opinion. Yeah. It's now, good. yeah. Now, there's something else that we do on the on gotta pick them. And Grids, I'm gonna let you go first. Match what? of the week. Oh. What do you think is gonna, gonna be the have best battle? Ben and best Demon. battle of the week. Easy. Ben and Demon. Yeah. Very even battle. Both at really good skill levels. Lovers? Levels? Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, uh, Demon is very unique when he battles, so I always like watching what Demon does in his battles. Uh, and then, I don't know, Ben's Asian. <laughs> <laughs> he's got what? a good draft. There you go. <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Kendra, match of the week. I don't want to go next. Someone else go next. What the hell? Stop, stop this. Yeah. No, no, you have to. I've already called your name. Feels. <laughs> Don't care about feels. Uh, uh, I'm looking at all the matches and I'm trying I'm trying to pick. Mm, Max versus Jaki, Battle of the Birds. <laughs> I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Grids didn't pick that. <laughs> no, I was gonna pick uh, Young Pachi and Daniel. Young Pachi and Daniel. <laughs> yeah, that would be lit. Yeah, uh, thanks. Battle of the Birds. It's gonna be good. All right. Well, V Sync. Ben and Demon, just because it's ben. so close and evenly balanced. All right. Well, I'm going to have to go with Grids and V-Sing, and I really think that Demon and Ben's battles... You got so confused what you said right there. <laughs> what? Hey, we, we don't I'm battle yet. I'm going Grids and V-Sing. I was like, wait, <laughs> that's not a battle. <laughs> no. I, uh. I was going to say, hold up, you're about 15 weeks off real quick. Hey, when that run comes, that's my battle of the week. Me and oh you, my Grids. God, stop. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to have to go with uh, Ben and Demon, because, I mean, I really, really think that it's going to be a good one. And ironically, I just realized Demon versus Lee, round one was the match 
of the week. And then my pick for last round was you uh, was V Sing versus Demon and this Demon's a common factor in my 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 <laughs> in this. So De Demon go. is is interesting to say the least. Demon's it, battles are always fun and entertaining to watch, regardless that, of outcome. This is true. Um now one last thing. On the screen was your screen? <laughs> on your screen for the viewers, you will see that there is a record. And the current it. record is I have twelve correct picks and V Sing has eleven. Erica got I lucky. am I am finally back in the lead. <laughs> Erica's getting lucky. It's fine. We're still in early days, just wait on it. What? Just wait on just wait until Daniel Erica, starts we got people this. back. Erica, you're about to get that one win real quick. For oh, me. True. Loki, let's go. Do it. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> that off chance that I win is about I don't know, one and a half out of a hundred chance. Yeah, let's go. Do it. Well, all right, I think I think that's it. We've covered everything. Yep. yep. All right, happy so, birthday. Yeah, happy birthday, everyone. Good luck to <laughs> all the battlers, all the coaches, all the teams. Uh, battles will be up this weekend on Sunday on the coaches' channels. I believe there'll be one on the CCL channel between Lee and Murray. Yes. So, yeah, go check that out. Go sub to everyone, like this video, leave a comment, leave your predictions if you want. We'd like to hear what you guys think. Um, Erica and I will be back in two weeks with the Gotta Pick Em All for Round 4. I'm not sure who we'll have yet with us. Maybe grades are Kendra again. We don't be know. Back. You, you you will be or you won't be back. I'll be back. You'll be back. Okay. So um, I don't know. Eric and I will definitely see you in a couple weeks. Grids and Kendra might, but other than that, everyone say bye. <laughs> bye. See you, niggers. <laughs> <laughs>